300 you, you discover what's next. 300, 300, 300, 300 TNT. You see the trophy, ho, you talking to the breadwinner. The motivators of the culture. They not us, they can't do what we do. What about it? It just goes on and on and on. Yo, what up? It's Kevin Lyles, and we're back for another episode of 300 U. I'm so excited to be back in New York, boogie down Bronx. I'm going to holler at my girl Mia. I want y'all to say less as she sings more. Yo, Mia, what's up? Seems like life's moving faster. Hey, I've been running away from disasters. Yeah, and I've been trying to catch a hold on. resonate with things that we see on TV or listen to, we want to feel heard. So honestly, I just want my, my fans to feel heard, to feel understood, um, and just feel happy when they listen to a song. just about life in itself. At the time, I, I was kind of stressed about whatever. Um, and the, the song itself just talks about not wanting to care about what other people think, um, not knowing what's coming in the future, and just kind of being in the moment, not having to explain how I feel about someone or something. Um, and just life itself, I think it's very chill. I think it captures the feeling of uh, not knowing what's gonna happen next, but just kind of being present 
Um, oftentimes we feel certain things and we can't really convey it to someone. We can't really explain why we feel a certain way, but we do. Um, and people don't like to be questioned. Like, if I like something, why are you questioning me about it? You know what I mean? Being from the Bronx has definitely influenced the way that I make music. Um, the culture itself, there's a lot of culture in the Bronx, a lot of different um, diversities and um, the music itself, there's a lot of hip hop, there's a lot of uh, Latin music. Um, if, so being from the Bronx, I have to influence, I have to infuse that into my music. Um, so like for example, I have Blink for Night Acho, which is kind of like hip hop and uh, a little harder than my usual stuff. Um, and we have like Baila, which is Latin, because I'm Puerto Rican. Um, and also like the, the fashion too, like, um, I don't know, like this for example. It's very like graffiti almost. Um, and there's like a certain swag that comes with being from the Bronx. Take a couple steps back I'll refrain from texting back What can I say? I think of you every day I'm fighting off this feeling I know I'm overthinking As an artist coming up, I would just say Just make what kind of music you like Don't try and uh, make something for other people. If you don't like it, don't make it. Make something that suits you and, and that you have fun making. It's, it's hard to, or not hard, but it kind of sucks to make music that you're not vibing with or you're making to, to please someone else. The best uh, thing to do is just work on something that you love. And when you work on something you love, it doesn't feel like you're working. Stop my heart from hurting Being alone's not working Tell me I'm over Mia, thank you so much. Guys, this is what happens when you study your craft and you practice, you practice. LaGuardia School of the Arts, she grew up on 106 in Park. She has so many inspirations. We love you, Mia. Thank you for coming out. Make sure you subscribe, like, comment, and let us know where we're going to next. This is Kevin Lyles. God bless you and good night. People who push the culture forward, they not us. They can do what we do. 300, 300, 300, 300. Get with us, we gonna change your life. Yeah.